everyone, it's Jim and Jess, and if you're new to my channel, then welcome, and if you're not, then welcome back. In this video, I'm going to be doing a whip and chat, aka a work in progress in chat. So, if you haven't already, please grab whatever it is that you're working on and work along with me, if you want. Um, disclaimer first, you might hear noises in the background sometime dur during this video or throughout the video. I live next to a freeway exit, so if you do, then I'm apologizing in advance, but hopefully you won't. Um... Give me a second. I'm grabbing a soda real quick. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, I hope everyone had a great week this past week. Um, I hope it's only been a week since I've done a whip and chat, but I swear it never fails. Every time I go to Diamond Paint, I, I find hair all over me. Um, okay. Oh, I am still working on this canvas you see right here. Um, uh, the canvas I'm doing for Drilla Beast called Transformation by Stephanie Little Bird Fogle from Distracted by Diamonds. This canvas is a size 52 by 67 centimeter and it's a full square drill. Um, so, I mean, I like am literally lagging. I mean, not on purpose, but sorry guys, I should have gotten set up before I decided to turn on the camera, but that's okay. You'll forgive me, right? <laughs> um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, this canvas, you guys. Okay, so when I saw it on the website, like the Patty Wax website or whatever, I thought it was gonna be a lot of, not a lot, but mostly color blocking, because when you see it, it looks like thick, just like, you know, blocks of color. Um, no, so wrong. It is the most confetti I've ever had. It is insane confetti, okay? Like, to the point where I have to take breaks because I just get like so tired of just getting another container of colors, you know, do, 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 like, oh my gosh, it's insane. Like, I love it, but it is insane. And I hope you guys can see okay. Hopefully I can zoom it in on the editor, but all right, I'm going to sit my ass down now. I'm sorry. <laughs> what was I doing? I need to open my drink. I'm so thirsty. Um, so yeah, still working on this canvas. I highly doubt I'll be able to finish it by the end of the month, but that's okay if I don't. Um, I'm gonna try to finish it all the way through, but I might have to take a break and do something else because so much confetti, it's insane. I'm not a confetti person. Um, I will be using my Wilson 3D Design Tray, like always, uh, from Etsy. My Donna Bass pen over there on Facebook. Um, probably gonna be the only pen I work on because actually I'm started using again the museum putty off Amazon you can get it I'll link everything down below in the description box like I always do but um, I totally forgot about this like I was so over the wax getting on the drills so I was um, doing the regular pink wax that comes free in the kit but I was so over like real quick over having to refill it every like five minutes it seemed like because I'm such a hard presser I it comes out like literally in a few minutes um, so I was like, oh yeah, duh, the putty. And I'm so glad I remembered I had um, had that. It looks like this. I don't have the outer packaging, but it's like that white tacky stuff. I hope I'm showing you in the camera because I have the camera the other way. But um, I highly recommend you get some, like at least try it, especially if you're a hard presser because this whole thing costs $2.88, I think $2.88 on Amazon. Like it's a huge pack and it lasts forever um you gotta mess with it like what i do is i'll here let me show you i'll roll it between my fingers like you only need a tiny bit right and like i hope you can see so i have this tiny little ball and i roll it and then i just like press it down into the hole and then i all like really hard and then i like scrape off around the edges and then just kind of like dab in there like you, you kind of gotta mess with it but um see like that you know if you have nails, it's a little harder, of course, but, uh, yeah, I highly recommend this stuff. It's awesome. No residue, nothing. And it lasts, like, seriously, it could last me half the day most of the time, if, depending how much I diamond paint, but, so I'll be using this. Um, if I do go to another pen, it'll be the one by, uh, 802 Diamond Painting Pens by Lisa over on Facebook as well, but hopefully I won't have to switch pens. Um, so yes. That is that. Uh, let's grab a color here. 
did I say everything I wanted to say? Yeah, I think so. Oh gosh, of course when I start filming, the train has to go by. I live by a train too, by the way. Isn't that awesome? Not. Uh, <laughs> okay, uh, what color am I gonna work on? Ew, I don't wanna work on S. I think I'll start on I. Okay, let me grab a color real quick, you guys. Like I said, I hope everyone had a great week the past week. Um, mine was interesting. I mean, it was pretty much the same, same old, same old, you know? Um, so, sorry, I'm trying to look for this dang color. Uh, I'm having this little box right here. Here it is. 799, hope you can see that blue color. Oh, you know what? I need to turn my light pad off. Duh. Sorry, guys. I was like, why does something seem off? <laughs> there we go. I don't know. Let me see if you guys can see better, like, that. Can you? I don't think you can. I think I'm just going to leave it on. If it's an issue, let me know. I'm just trying to, like, change setups here so you can see closer to my canvas. So, if you like it with it on, let me know so next time I can either leave it on or if you don't like it on I can leave it off if that makes sense let's see uh yeah same old same old happened uh oh my gosh you guys are gonna laugh okay so I got in a little argument yesterday with just guess the neighbor no it wasn't the neighbor actually it was his mom right so you guys are gonna oh okay so you'll never believe what happened so a few days ago, like my boyfriend was getting up and getting ready for work and all of a sudden we heard someone like, he like literally was running late as usual. And so he had like five minutes, if that, to go and like, we heard this pounding on the door, right? Like boom, 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 like it's the police or something. Like what the hell? Like who the hell is that? Cause like, no one comes here for me. Like I don't have friends. Okay. So it's always usually 99% of the time for him. I was like. You know, oh, tell your friends to leave. Da, da, da. Excuse my language, but basically that's how I was saying it. And uh, <laughs> he's like, I don't know who that is. He's like, I gotta go to work. And then all of a sudden I hear, Sammy, right? And it's the neighbor's mom. Like, and he's like, Yeah, what's up? She's like, What are you doing right now? And he's like, uh, I'm running late to work. I'm trying to get ready to go to work right now. She's like, I need you to take. Uh, what'd she say? Oh, I need you to take to the hospital I think he's overdosing and I was like okay what like okay so first she said I need you to take P to the hospital which is the neighbor like what she calls him so after I heard those words I was like you fucking take him because <laughs> I can't stand her okay and uh, yeah I'm not a very nice person so <laughs> well I am just not to people that you know steal from me or whatever it may be so, um, but then she said the overdosing part and I was like, what? I'm like, that's your kid. Like, and Sammy's like, I can't. He's like, sorry, like I gotta go to work. And I knew right away, okay, she was bullshitting and she just didn't want to deal with it because if your kid was really overdosing, I'm sorry, I'm pretty sure you'd be like on point calling 911 and the ambulance would have been here by now. Like she just he was just fucked up I think or high and she just didn't want to deal with him and she, but she didn't want to like probably leave and worry about him you know like I don't know don't know but it was weird I would never ask someone to take my kid to the hospital for me if they were on the verge of death but that's just me okay um so yeah so I was like dude I can't like what I have to go to work and you can take him that's your son like I'm confused okay so then she like proceeded to text me the next morning sorry about last night because sammy gave her my number yeah that was a great fight um am i done with this already um sorry i have such a hard time like talking and doing this at the same time sometimes um yeah i guess so yeah <clears throat> so she texts me like oh um sorry about yesterday um he was just having a panic attack i think and i panicked dude so you're playing crying wolf like no not cool and ew just go away like i can't stand you right so and the reason why i like say it like that i don't want to be sound like so mean but i don't care because it's like 
this chick, like, you know when you meet someone and you just know they're fake from the gate? And I don't do that. Like, I don't do the fake stuff, okay? Like, because I feel like you're hiding or lying to me, hiding something or lying to me, right? So I just immediately, something was off about her. I didn't like her. It wasn't the fact that it was his mom, because she was really nice and sweet, but just something didn't seem right. You know, I have that, like, women's instinct thing, you know? So, but it's like one of those things where you meet somebody, you know, and they're so nice to you and everything, but you just don't like them and you don't know why. And you don't want to say you don't like them because you don't want to be like a bitch or whatever. But yeah, that was me from the gate. I just didn't know what it was. I didn't like her. And I kept telling Sammy that like something's not right. I don't know. Because he's always like, you always don't like everybody. <laughs> like, Why don't you just be nice, you know? But sure enough, it came out later why like as usual, like the truth always comes to the light, right? Um, sure enough, she ends up lying to people saying Sammy was like shooting up drugs with her son in the parking lot or something like he doesn't even hang out with him dude like you must have had like not your, not have had your glasses on that day like my boyfriend doesn't get high first of all like okay he smokes weed sometimes like whatever but not like that like only sometimes because of his carpal tunnel like it's the only thing he says that really kind of makes the pain edge off that and Tylenol you know but besides that like no you got me messed up dating a dude that shoves needles in his arms. I'm sorry. Um, so ever since she started pulling that shit, I was like, oh, hell no. Like, you know what I mean? So, um, so she says sorry the next day. And then yesterday, Sammy's, he, you know, works all night. Like, and he's trying to sleep. And I hear this, the neighbor yelling at his mom about some, the dog or something. Like, screaming like a little kid. Like, so I go outside because I'm getting pissed. Because this happens every day. And I'm like, and I see her, I'm like, excuse me, like, I was nice at first, okay? <laughs> Give me some credit. I was like, excuse me, um, can you please tell your son to try and keep it down? Like, my boyfriend's sleeping, and she just stares at me. And I'm like, do you hear me? Like, hello? You know, I'm like talking to a freaking wall. And she's like, eh, you could be a little more nicer. And then I cut her off, because then he walked up, and I was like, hey, can you please keep it down? I'm like, Sammy's trying to sleep, because he actually has a job and works all night. You know, like, basically saying, maybe you should do the same, like, low-key. Um, yeah. So, then she just said it again. Oh, you could be a little more nicer when you say that, or next time you ask that. And I was like, um, I'll be nice when my shit stops getting stolen because of your son's drug addict friends. And she's like, I'm not a drug addict. <laughs> I'm like, what? You're dumber than a bucket of rocks. I said, I didn't even say that. I'm like, I said... I'll be nice when my shit stops getting stolen from your son's drug addict friends. Clean your ears, lady. Like, And then I walked back in the house because then my adrenaline started getting to me and I wanted to knock her out. And like, I know I have anger management issues. Like, I can't take the classes. They're too expensive. I promise I like looked them up and went to go, you know, but it's, I've been good. I haven't gotten in a fight in like almost three years. So give me some credit, okay? Probably because I don't have any friends or know anybody out here, but that's not the point. All right, at least I'm trying, you know? Uh, so yeah, that was interesting. Like, you come to my house, like, telling us we need to take your son to the hospital because he might be overdosing on drugs, and then you want to go and act like you're Miss Perfect and, like, you're not a drug addict. Like, miss me. Miss me with that. Like, I just, I can't handle or idiots. I just can't do it, you know? Um... So yeah, that was interesting. Hold on, I need to find another color. Welcome to my life. <laughs> um, my boy boyfriend had his birthday though, the past, what was it, Sunday? I think it was the 6th. Um, I made him a birthday cake and I finally got to make that roast, which was cool. It turned out so good. I made it with like potatoes, and red potatoes, yellow potatoes, carrots, celery, um, you know, the onion, what is it, the French onion dip, um, water, because it was in a crock pot, and, uh, celery, carrots, potatoes, salt, pepper, you know, just that kind of stuff. It wasn't, like, anything fancy, but it was so good. Um, oh, and I made him a birthday cake. It was yellow, my favorite. <laughs> it's his, he likes it, too. He doesn't really have a favorite, but, so he didn't really care, because I asked him, I'm like, what do you want? And I said, please don't say German chocolate cake, because I hate that. I, I like chocolate. I love chocolate, but I don't like the coconut part, you know? So, um, 
he's like no no no. he's like let's do that yellow cake you like i'm like all right sweet like i'm obsessed with yellow cake and chocolate fudge icing oh with the the um you know the red pink white and blue sprinkles it's like the little little balls sprinkle balls like oh so obsessed anyways so i made that that was bomb too um i mean it's not that hard to make cake but you know what i mean so that was good and i got him a bunch of stuff for work for his birthday like i got him the gloves like that go all the way up to here like the industrial gloves because he's a sanitizer guy you know so he's literally sitting in bleach and chlorine and disinfectant all day like it's really messing up his skin he's got chlorine rash on both his arms now going all the way up and so i had to buy a bunch of um hydrocortisone and this stuff called aqua swim i think it's for swimmers really like to prevent chlorine rash um but it's supposed to be the best so i'm hoping it helps block any more coming into his skin because he already has like really sensitive skin so and it sucks because not only does he have it he gave it to me because he like first after the first few days of working there he like touched my back or scratched my back for me or something and ever since that was like a month and a half ago when he like first started my back has been itching and red hives for literally almost a month now like and i couldn't figure it out i'm like babe look at my back like i was scared i almost went to the hospital because i was like this is not normal like my back isn't shouldn't be itching in this one spot you know for a freaking month and it's like bumpy feeling like that weird rashy hivey feel you know and sure enough we figured it out because then he started getting it real bad his arms are all red and stuff like from it and so i looked it up and it was chlorine rash at least that's what the google said and uh so you know we've been uh putting that hydro on it and stuff and it's mine's almost gone i just got a little spot left but gosh it drives me it's like every morning the first thing i have to do is like scratch my back for 30 minutes and then it makes it worse you know so i got him that and then i got him those really dank masks they have that like it's for people that work in like big refrigerators or like for cold weather like motorcycle people like when they ride bikes and the wind hits their face you know when you go outside and it's so cold like <gasps> you like can't breathe at least that's what happens to me here all the time but yeah um 219 i just uh i got him a sick ass mask with a it's like it covers his whole face neck everything it has like that built-in mask for his mouth you know so it helps them breathe in the cold weather so i hope that helps because right now he's using those cheap covid19 masks those blue ones that everyone wears and it ain't doing nothing for him poor guy so i got him those and i got him some chemical resistant long sleeve shirts oh and i also got myself a heater for his birthday while i was shopping on amazon for him so yeah, I finally got a heater. It actually arrives tomorrow. Yay! I can stop being so freaking cold. Luckily, though, it's been warm the past couple days, so it doesn't get too cold until around, like, midnight or... Excuse me. You know, the hiccups. Midnight or so. Then it starts getting, like, 20 degrees, and it's a wrap from there. I literally have my toaster oven in my bathroom right now because it's so freaking cold. I just leave it on all night. <laughs> yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? <laughs> um so yeah i got him that for his birthday um what else happened uh, that's about it i wrote it down um yeah that's about it that was my week pretty much um i oh and i've been like trying to push through on this painting but it's just been like ugh, confetti overload um yeah it was funny because you know i posted or a uh, a post review you know of diy moon shops canvas that i did and someone on instagram asked me oh wow are you an affiliate now and i was like pa no i was like you won't catch me ever being an affiliate i'm just saying like and i said i promise you that <laughs> you know facts like and it's not that i'm like i don't like affiliates or anything like that um i think it's a really smart business move but i <laughs> on both ends you know but i just i don't agree with um i just can't i'm too uh you know open-minded blunt speak my mind and and just can't help but be honest you know whether i'm getting paid to lie or not i'll still tell the truth because i can't lie like that's just something i'm not about and i'm not about um being fake you know so which is like pretty much the same thing in my opinion 
not saying affiliates are fake, but like if I don't like something from the company, I'll have a real hard time not saying it or, you know, because I know sometimes, or from what I've heard, some places that hire affiliates like diamond painting companies, if you say the wrong thing, you're either fired or like get reprimanded or something like God forbid, you know? Um, <laughs> and yeah, I just, it just wouldn't last very long with me. So I was like, nah, I'm straight on that. I'm like, I just really love their paintings. <laughs> But yeah, don't trip. It's just like, oh, okay. <laughs> it was funny. It was like she was almost relieved, it sounded like. But, but yeah, I just thought that was funny. Um, uh, anyways, um, what else? What else? What else? <laughs> oh, yeah. So I've got... Um, I did a, a little too much shopping. What else is new, right? Uh, <laughs> when was it? was it oh yeah when I was shopping for Sammy's presents um so I got what did I get I have so many I can't wait because I'm excited because I get the stuff but also because I'll be able to unbox some, some more stuff on um for you guys like on YouTube you know um I got two I got some storages for my drills like I'm gonna try something new and I'm gonna film it so you guys can maybe see if you like it and try it out yourself i don't know just a little new idea and then i got um tons of dp with sparklers actually they should hopefully be here maybe by tomorrow or the next day tons of them i already have a couple um that i had gotten you know for my splatter alien canvas but i, I went a little overboard and got like way way more um so that's cool we can see some of those and then um did I get any diamond paintings? Oh, I did. I did. I know. I really shouldn't have, but I couldn't help it. Like, I really wanted these two from, of course, Distracted by Diamonds. And it was the last one. And I was like, dude, I can't say no. And all of a sudden, my fingers just pressed the button, buy now. And it was a wrap from there. Um, It was this mermaid one. I don't remember what it was called or whatever. But one of the mermaid ones Distracted by Diamonds has that never really... You know comes out anymore and if it does it's gone like that i think i've seen a couple of them on facebook groups before but they were gone by the time i got money and i was like dang it <laughs> oh and i ordered like so many more pens i know i'm so ridiculous like i need help i seriously why do you like pens so much but hey people have been coming over to my house and seeing them and complimenting me on them and they don't even know what they are they always actually they always think that they're the um I guess dab things like you know the smoking weed hash THC dab things I don't know um but no one was like no those are pens <laughs> those are cracked pens excuse me you <laughs> you know <laughs> no, I'm just kidding no but for real like I'm like what you mean dabber tools like I know what I thought they were just like those sticks like those chrome sticks or whatever the heck they're called I have no idea I don't smoke but yeah at least I get compliments on them so I got more. No. <laughs> it's like one of those things. I think I'm more addicted to buying stuff for diamond painting than I am diamond painting. Like, it's getting a little retarded. Like, I just need to knock it off, you know? <laughs> I really do. Is anyone else like that? Probably. I hope so, because I hope I'm not alone in that. Um, yeah, so what else did I get? Oh, I got some more. I'm actually going to film an unboxing after this, um, so I'm not going to say what else I got, but Pretty much, I got some unboxings coming up for you guys this week, and um, I don't think I'm going to be able to do the storage thing until, it said like it wasn't coming till March. I might have to cancel that order and like find something else. No, I'll just wait. Screw it. Um, yeah, a couple unboxings, accessory unboxings, um, mail stuff, and maybe a diamond painting unboxing, I don't know. Oh, and I finally got that legend. Did I tell you guys that yet? I don't think so. Remember I told you about, well, I did in my last whip and chat, um, how the legend didn't match up with the symbols on the canvas for that Sparkle Queen Creations canvas I got that I unboxed on my channel. Um, she finally sent me the legend, so maybe I can start <coughs> doing that one again, too. So I'll have, a, like, a post-review for you guys. Um, yeah. I just wanted to stop in and say hi. Sorry, I know I suck at whipping shots. This isn't going to be long because 
Um, I gotta do a couple more videos and I honestly just came here to um, announce something and that is for something for my subscribers. Um, I just got 300 subscribers so I am celebrating which I wanted to say thank you guys. You guys know how I feel about all of you subscribing and actually wanting to listen to me. I really appreciate you and um, don't take it lightly. So for my subscribers only, okay, not just the people that watch me to watch me, um, I am doing a giveaway for a $50 gift card. Um, and it's either, it's gonna be to pretty much out of all these diamond painting places. I think I wrote them down, I hope I did, please. Yes, so you can choose to get one from Diamond Art Club, DIY Moon Shop, uh, Pretty Me Creative, Royal Diamond Painting, Dreamer Designs, or I know some people actually want stuff for diamond painting or just need stuff in general, you can get a $50 gift card for Amazon. So if you win the draw or the giveaway, whatever it is, because I do it through a random spin wheel thingy and, and then I'll post it like on my Instagram. So you, if you can follow me on Instagram, if you want to enter to see, or if not, I'll, I'll announce it on here too. I do it at the same time, but I'll post the video on both um, YouTube first then Instagram probably because YouTube takes a while to load, unfortunately, and edit and stuff. Um, but yeah, so if you enter the giveaway and win, you, that is your choices for where you'll get the gift card from, okay? Um, so if you want to enter, just put in the comment, me or me please or whatever, and I will add you to the list. And again, this is only for my subscribers. So if you're not subscribed to me, uh, you might as well just not bother um, commenting because it's not going to happen. <laughs> I'm so stoked, you guys. That's crazy. Like, you know, I know um, it's not that many. Like, I'm still a small channel or whatever, but it's a lot to me because not even like five people in real life really like me, and that's a fact. So I just can't believe that many people are subscribed to me. And I just really, um, you already know what's up. Like, it just really touches me um touches my heart you know so thank you guys you guys are the best i know there was another in in here i hate that when you like you know you've seen it and you're trying to find it and then you're like oh i can't you know you give up and then you put the color back and then literally right after you're like oh there it is <laughs> yeah that's probably what's gonna happen to me right now um so yeah i just want to say thank you guys and to show my appreciation um oh i'm gonna have two winners duh how, how did i forget that so one's going to get the 50, the first place winner, okay? And then the, the second winner is going to get a $30 gift card, okay? Or is it 25? 25, I'm so sorry. It's going to be half of the 50, okay? So we get a $25 gift card. And for the second place, first place, we'll get 50, okay? So if you guys want to possibly enter uh, to win, to or if you guys want to possibly win to get a gift card from one of those shops or from Amazon, um, just... Let me know in the comments so I could uh, put you down on the list to enter you in the wheel. And I do it live, like I'll post the video live, like that I did it, whatever. Um, kind of like like if you scroll down my uh, YouTube videos, you'll see the first one I did where you can call me better one. That was cool. Um, so yeah, I'll do the same thing this time. So yeah, if you guys want to enter the giveaway, go for it. Um, you guys deserve it. Actually, I wish I could give you all something, but um, one day, okay, maybe one day, when I become a millionaire and have my own craft room, and I don't know how long that will be till then, but I promise you it will be soon. Um, <laughs> okay, maybe not soon. Watch, it's going to be like, when I'm 90 years old, I'll come up, you know? Um, <laughs> so yeah, there's um, my announcement for my subs. Um, just trying to make sure I got everything. I just wanted to say thank you guys so much. You guys mean the world to me, and I appreciate you, your feedback, your constructive criticism, all that stuff, uh, correcting me and everything. I want to take this journey not alone, so I'm glad I have, I get to take this diamond painting journey. Um, I get to take you along with me, you know, and it means a lot to me, so. So yes, um, that's pretty much all the whipping and chatting I'm going to be doing right now, because I need to finish filming the other videos for you guys. And again, if you want to enter, just put me or me please in the comments. Um, I'm going to announce the winner on Wednesday, okay? So 
Winter Wednesday, get it? <laughs> so yeah, just, um, again, you have till Wednesday and only if you're subscribed to me. Um, I hope you guys all have a great night and I will be posting up another video, um, when this is up because it's, what's today? What's today? I think today's Tuesday. This is Tuesday night. I, I think so. Okay. So I'll be posting this tomorrow, which is Wednesday. So you guys will have a week to enter, I guess, or, or to watch this video to enter. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I'll be posting that this video Wednesday and then I have another accessory unboxing Thursday, um, and friend mail. Uh, it's gonna be like a two for one and then um i'll be doing another uh probably diamond painting unboxing or a mail haul i'm not sure so that's gonna be on the agenda for this week for you guys um again i just want to say thank you to all my subs i love you so so much you guys are amazing um and yeah i will definitely see you soon okay and hopefully be posting more videos this week than i was last week <laughs> all right you guys i'll see you later okay bye Thank you.